back with another one. Crump battle prediction. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's jump right into this battle. So this one I find quite interesting. These two individuals are very similar in a lot of ways, with only maybe very subtle differences. Reflex arc versus Virgo. Let's check the stats on these two, shall we? Virgo is very buck, catty, very stylish, you know, when he dances on the floor. Material heavy and gets live. Very live dancer. Then we have Reflex Arc, who is buck. A little bit more material and concept heavy and live. And can be kind of catty when he wants to as well. I definitely see him making some changes in his own personal style. But we can still kind of sprinkle that on there. If you want to go based off of... Uh, his battles and uh, the tournament that he was in earlier this year for rookies versus vets. Um, but he definitely showed like, you know, some differences as far as like in his battle versus uh, crypto last month at King of the Ring. So when we look at these two, I find this funny because it's like if you like and I, I, I challenge you go literally watch these two. Just go watch them and you'll notice like they have very, very similar movements. I know that's that <laughs> don't kill me. Don't kill me. It, it is what it is. Like, I, I just I just happened to be, I was like, you know, let me just look at these two. And I watched them both, and I was just like, that's crazy. These two both have very similar applications whenever they crump. And I know some people may find that. They're like, oh, well, that's with everybody. Everybody's buck, and everybody, nah, nah, nah. Like, go watch them. Like, just literally go watch their most recent battles. Like, if you watch them dance, like, they both have similar just similar movements like similar movements like their texture is almost the same um they're both like i said they're both technical um reflex arc being a little bit more technical uh, in the battle especially when it comes to like applying like combos and material things of that nature um i definitely see that in my personal opinion in terms of get off i think virgo edges it um i think that he uses a lot more range of motion uses entire body level changes you know definitely messes with the texture as far as in terms of when he's actually getting off but in terms of building up around i see he's maybe just a little bit more catty or stylish um, and i think reflex arc takes his time and actually combines uh, a variety of different elements when it comes to crump into his craft um, so in this particular battle i think it's interesting because in the sense they both kind of have I don't want to call them issues, but I dare I say weaknesses. They're both still kind of finding themselves as far as in terms of their style. Like, I know they know who they are. But as far as like, again, whenever you watch dancers or people dance in general, you have to resonate with them on a particular frequency. You understand their style, like why they move, the way they move. You know, there are certain things that stand out about them. Like when you like examples like when you watch you know disco dance like he is very swag and very groovy but it's not like a caddy kind of groove like it's more like you know kind of season like i'm og like southern pimp he's got that old that spice adams flair to him you know what i'm saying you know so it, it is what it is you understand like how he dances and even when you even though he's twin flesh killer you still see that he still incorporates that into his style it's very southern so that's what I'm saying. Like when you watch certain people dance, they dance with certain textures like you resonate with them on different frequencies. And I'm not trying to sound like those weirdos who are always trying to use different terminologies in crump. And I'm pretty sure there's a motherfucker sitting behind the camera right now saying, well, you already do. So it is what it is. I'm just simply saying that you can watch two people do the exact same movement. But. The character and how they apply it or when they apply it is how you resonate with that particular dancer. So again, that's what I'm saying. They talk about quality and quantity. Let's just put it like that in a way that you can definitely understand. So I think these two definitely bring somewhat the same skill sets to the table. It just really depends on who brings it better. Again, like I said before, I do believe in my, I would say get off. If we're going to kind of start comparing these two in terms, I do like I'll give Virgo Virgo in my personal opinion has a better get off. 
again, as I've stated before, he, he's a lot more versatile in how he chooses to move. Um, and I definitely think in terms like when he gets live, like he can get there and stay there for quite some time. When we look at reflex arc, reflex arc can also get live and stay up there for a particular amount of time. But I would definitely say that he's a little bit limited as far as like how he moves because Virgo, and I don't want to say limited as far as he can't do it, but in terms of showcasing it or doing it on a regular basis, Virgo simply moves a little bit better than he does. Um, getting on the ground, getting up, and you know what I'm saying? It, it could be, you know, you know, reflex art and got a little bit of belly on him. He light skinned, so it, it, hey man, I told you, stop eating that bullshit. You know what I'm saying? That, that waste to get to you, brother. People don't understand how important your core is. If you're starting to get a little, a little heavy around the midsection, you will notice. Your ability to change levels will it it it, it 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 it'll change. Okay, take my advice for it. You know what I'm saying? You know, look how skinny I used to be. Look at me now, like boy, I'm, I still look good, but you know, I just huge difference. So, so for sure, I think that um, when we look at these two, they have different things that they are better um, than each other at. But I think it's going to come down to who brings, who presents the best package. So let's go into the prediction. So for the prediction for this particular battle, um, so I don't see any kill offs or one rounds in this particular battle. No disrespect to them, but they are these, these are the type of dancers who can beat you and one round you or you get killed off. But I don't think that it's by technical or shit I, don't know, I gotta stop saying that but i don't think it's for you lose to them because of movements i think that you would lose this battle to these particular two opponents because they're around you just never you're never able to close the gap in terms of like how high they set the bar for their first or their second round because these two both bring full rounds each time there's no question about that so i think this will be this is going to be a real fight a real fight. I don't think either one of them will get one rounded or killed off. I don't think either one of them would allow themselves to do that unless one of them just brings one of those magical movements out of the hat and they just happen to, you know, do that. But I don't see that happening. So my prediction for the winner, um, based off of, like I said, complete package, I'm going to go with reflex arc for this particular battle. Um, so I gave him the win um, because I believe he brings a broader package. And like I said, he does bring material and combos uh, whenever he battles. So his arsenal is a little bit more versatile or shall I say well-rounded. I won't say versatile. I'll just say well-rounded. I do think that combos and material can definitely help kind of close the gap uh, between, you know, battling somebody who is just, you know, toe to toe for you. Like sometimes you need a good movement or excuse me, a good move to distance yourself from your opponent. Because if y'all are just going round for round, back to back and stuff like that, and you don't have moves or you don't have something to finish your opponent or show that they can't, you know, attack you back or hit you with a good one real quick, then you're ultimately, at the end of the day, you're always going to be fighting at a battle of attrition. You know, if some person comes out there and y'all have the both same skill sets, you both have nice rounds, they're composed well, you're in the music, you're in the beat, and it's just nicely flowing along. The person hits you with a, a hat move, and they land it, boom. That's a distance. That's something you're going to have, that opponent's going to have to rebuttal that in some way, shape, form, fashion. Either you're going to do it with your crump, um, and I mean as far as in terms of like, you're going to have to do it through get off, or without any moves or anything, um, or you're going to have to rebuttal it with a move of your own. Um, but I definitely think that in this particular battle, um, I do think that uh, Reflex Arc brings a better um, package as far as in terms of Crump overall. So um, I'm edging the battle to him. So I now I don't not going to sit here and in no way, shape, form, or fashion am I going to sleep on uh, on Virgo because the man is nice. He's hella nice, and I see what he brings to the table. So this definitely is not a battle that Reflex Arc can slack on. So I think if he leaves the door open uh, for Virgo to come in here and sprint past him, or even he might bring some some movements of his own, we don't know. 
We didn't really get. We didn't. We saw him in the tournament. We we saw him in the session, but we didn't unfortunately get, didn't get to see him battle at this particular event in a in a pre-selected battle. So I'm pretty damn sure that he's preparing for this one. Uh, but based off of the facts and the evidence that I have here, I'm going with Reflex Arc. So it is what it is. Let me know what you think. Like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Get this information out to these people. Talk back to you, boy. I want to know what your opinion is in regards to these battles. Hope you have a good one. Peace.